Hello everybody, this is Michael Smiley coming at you with another review video. Um, today I'm going to talk about the Jurassic World series. <coughs> so, Jurassic World... Well, let's talk about Jurassic Park in general. Jurassic Park is an amazing franchise. Um, originally based on a book series, um, at least the first two. And um, it is really excellent. They have top-notch acting. Obviously, Steve, Steven Spielberg um, did the first two, three. Well, anyway, um, so then they didn't reboot it. They continued it, but with a different name title, Jurassic World. So it separated the two trilogies. Um because their Jurassic World is going to be as its own trilogy, and they've already done two. So the first Jurassic World was really awesome. Um, I went to theaters and saw that. It was it was really good. Um, and then I had my reservations about the second Jurassic World because um, some of the headlines were that they were gonna weaponize dinosaurs and all this other nonsense and the way that you read it versus the way that it's translated are two different things um, but Jurassic World 2 went nothing how um, it was said to have gone and I really, really like the darker tone of the second one. And I really love how intimate the second one is versus the first one. The first one did seem like a bigger movie. Because it had to do with, you know, more with the park and a lot more people and everything. And the second one was more intimate. Um, I am very curious and interested to know how... Or where they're going to take the third movie of the Jurassic World trilogy. And um, they brought back Jeff Goldblum for a little bit for the, uh, the Jurassic World and Fallen Kingdom. And I really thought that that was awesome. I hope that they bring back um, a lot of the original characters and have them... Um, you know, have contact with the newer characters because in Jurassic World, um, Clary, I didn't like her character at first. I thought she was terrible. And then she made a transition, a slow burning transition where I loved her by the end of the movie. Um, I think that the third act of the first Jurassic World was insane, and I thought that it was excellent. I thought it was great. Um, but I loved the scarier tone of Fallen Kingdom more, especially with like the opening scene with the underwater submarine and it, it being like three or five years later or something, and um, thinking that the huge... Uh, creatures in the water and everything they it was just so it was so great it was so excellently done um yeah and that creature made at the end uh oh my god what did they call that uh the indoraptor or whatever it was that was scary <laughs> It was, um, yeah, it was a lot scarier than the, um, Indominus Rex that they had in the first Jurassic World movie. So, yeah, that was kind of crazy. I love Blue. I love how they really point to her being special and her being a leader, um, you know, she's awesome. And... 
that's what we took away from the first Jurassic World was that she was awesome, and it's a really awesome thing that they brought her back for the second one, and they did get into detail on how and why she's special and everything. And I really, really, really love where they're going with it and what they've done with it. I'm curious to know how they're going to do the third one, though, because once you think that they can't go anywhere, they do. They think of something, so I'm just curious to know what that something is because they've done excellent so far, and they're off the island now. So now you have dinosaurs that are going to be intermingling with the human world and probably going to cause some chaos, but, you know, that's what Jurassic World and Jurassic Park is all about. So um, that's really, really exciting. Um, and they're beautifully shot. Especially, it look, they look excellent in 4K, so... I can't wait to see the next one in theaters. Hopefully it comes out soon. So, um, I just I can't believe that the dinosaur engineer went from being the good guy in the first original Jurassic Park movie to being the a bad guy. And he's not bad, but he's a mad scientist. He makes monsters, creatures for money so we'll see how the next one goes um yeah i hope the originals come back so there's that um if you like my review um just comment below and we can talk about the the jurassic park and jurassic world franchise because i love it and until next time guys have a great day